Okay, hi guys. So let's look at this question here. Okay, so if you read this question, uh, A sold an article after giving X percent discount and earned a profit of forty four percent. Had he sold the article after giving two point five X percent discount, he would have earned a profit of twenty percent. What would be the profit percentage if he gives three X percent discount, right? Well, in the first go, this question may not look that difficult to you, right? But we learn. And uh, we learn a very logical shortcut, a fantastic way to solve such problem, right? A very logical shortcut to solve such problems, and it's a great concept, right? So see this concept here. How to solve this question here? Okay. So in the first case, see is that uh, there's a discount given. What is the discount given here? Discount given is X percent. Take care. And the profit earned is what? So profit earned is how much? Profit earned is forty four percent. Okay. Now, had he sold the article after giving two point five x percent discount, so now profit is two discount is two point five x percent. So if a shopkeeper gives more discount, that means his profit will be less. Correct. So if if a shopkeeper gives more discount, his profit will be less. So what I can say that guys, that discount is always inversely proportional to profit of shopkeeper. Right. More discount the shopkeeper gives, less profit he makes. Right. So now in this case now discount is two point five x percent and now the profit earned is how much twenty percent. So what would be the profit percent if he gives a discount of three x percent? Okay. Now we can solve this question uh, very logically. We can see here that uh, it says that in discount there is a gap of one point five percent, right? So x to one point five x. So I can say that. There's a gap of one point five percent in discount. Okay, so in obviously in terms of X rates, if a, there's a gap of one point five percent in discount, okay, and actually it creates a gap of twenty four percent in profit. Okay, so what I can say that a gap of one point five percent in discount creates a gap of twenty four percent in profit. Okay. So now I can use this funda here. Discount is obviously inversely proportional to profit. So more is a discount percentage, uh, less is the profit percentage. So discount percentage is always inversely proportional to profit percentage. So what I know obviously, guys, I know that whenever A is inversely proportional to B, so how do we write that? Right? We write A one by A two is equal to B two by B one. We learned this in ratios, right? So when two quantities are inversely proportional, how do we write? One by two equal to two by one. Or if it is actually proportional, if if it is written that A is proportional to B, so how do we write A one by A two equal to B one by B two? Okay, so we learn this in ratios, right? So now same thing I I I'll apply here. Okay, so let's see this, guys. So actually this this says that now A one by A two equal to B by B one by B two by B one. If a uh, discount is inversely proportional to profit, so I can write here. D one by D two is equal to P two by P one. That means D one P one is equal to D two P two. All are getting this right? D one P one is equal to D two P two. Okay. So now let's just solve this question now. So we've done all the uh, basic uh, necessary things here. Okay. Before solving this question, let's just solve it. So now just use this funda here, guys. So I can use this funda directly now that uh, we have a D one P one here. Is equal to d two p two, okay. So what I can write here is the discount for of one point five percent extra discount of one point five percent creates a gap of twenty four percent. So profit is for twenty four percent for this gap is equal d two p two. So now uh, d two value I need I know that is three x. So now discount of three x percent is will make profit of how much? That's the question, right? So if you solve it actually, guys. Okay, obviously this will be one point five x here. Correct. This will be one point five x if you solve it. Okay, this twenty four percent. So this is one point five because x minus two point five x minus x will be one point five x. So let me write here one point five x. Okay. So now I can just solve this. Uh, this all percentage part we can uh, cancel actually, uh, and x we can also cancel here. Okay. So we can cancel cancel x percentage here. So now P two will be equal to twenty four uh, into. I'm sorry, three x right? Yeah. Okay. So now uh, P two is equal to what? So if you if you see here, 
so 3 this is 24 and this is 1.5 okay so that means 24 into 1.5 is 36 by 3 so p2 is equal to 12 so 12 percent is the answer for this question right so very logical question and a very logical way of solving this question right you can apply this fund in all such questions okay wherever discount uh, wherever discount and profit is given so and uh, you can solve this by this question and avoid unnecessary equations you can avoid here okay so a great funda you must remember this okay Shalom. thank you for watching guys and also also this combat guys okay so this a uh, combat uh, you know it's a very good test series it contains some good high quality questions okay so their easy questions are, are not asked here so it basically it contains only good uh, medium and high quality questions with some uh, very advanced concepts okay and uh, uh, this from this sunday onwards it is in basically revised format so basically we are mo moving closer to cat right now so in january february and march we were like away uh, we are around eight to ten months away from cat so the questions we put off maybe some uh, easier or medium level right but this from down onwards the questions will be of higher higher level okay and uh, all the LRDA sets also um, this quant questions also and basically it's a fun it's fun right actually giving this is a fun because after every question you get to get, get, get your live ranking okay then uh, after every question the faster you answer the better your the better your rank is right you get more points so actually those one hour test is a fun and actually if you look at the cat you should give uh, multiple uh, sectional tests and tests before cat okay and this is one of your high quality tests absolutely free of cost and uh, now from uh, earlier it was not that rewarding but now they have introduced some uh, great rewards in this i think okay so rank one two three one year subscription i think around twenty thousand or seventy five percent scholarship or fifty percent so sir great prizes are on offer here okay so get it live from your mobile app you just put the uh, link here i'll uh, this uh, invite code you can put here ravi roda it ask you for invite code it is absolutely absolutely free of cost okay ask you for invite code put ravi roda and the link i'll put in description just enroll from there okay and do give this every sunday do give this at 12 pm it's on every sunday okay so every sunday give this on 12 pm thank you